Hey, my name is Dan Gage and I make harmonica lessons on YouTube. I've been getting a lot of emails over the years since I've been doing this about the subject will be, hey Dan, I've got a 32 hole harmonica, what do I do with it? And, and the short answer is, I don't know. But I went out and I bought a 32 hole harmonica for you guys and I thought I'd make a little video to talk about it or what, what little I know about it. So it looks like this, the one that I have. It's called the Honer Weekender. And you'll notice that there's 16 rows of two holes each for a total of 32. And what I wanted to do was tell you a little bit about it, but also give you some background on harmonicas in general. So my forte, my interest, my hobby, my passion is towards what are known as diatonic, 10-hole diatonic harmonicas, otherwise known as blues harps kind of look like that and you'll see these frequently in jazz music folk music uh, rock and roll blues especially blues and all sorts of uh, all sorts of music so this this is your more common instrument at least in modern popular music however there are a whole lot of different kinds of harmonicas out there uh, the analogy I like to make is towards stringed instruments just the way uh, a cello and a banjo don't sound anything like one another they are based on the same principle of a, of a string vibrating. In the harmonica world, there's a whole bunch of different kinds of harmonicas that are based on this concept of a reed that's fixed at one end and it, and it vibrates to make the noise. So there are, from the smaller, you know, the diatonic harmonicas, and all the way up, there are what are known as chromatic harmonicas. There are octave harmonicas, tremolo harmonicas, chord harmonicas. There are bass harmonicas, there are orchestral harmonicas, great big things that like you'll see pictures of two guys, two guys playing them at the same time in an orchestra setting. It's, it's really a whole world of them out there, and I'm, and I'm not really an expert, but I took the Weekender out, um, I bought it just for you guys, and what it does is it, the tremolo's got two, when you're, when you're playing the two notes, the notes are offset in pitch, to get this neat sort of sort of effect, and I think they were used um, for for different types of folk music. I think of them as like campfire harps, and what you'll get is this neat. Let me see if I can do it. Hear that sort of beating sound? That's the two notes that are slightly off pitch, kind of working together to make a to make a different note. And so what what I figured out recently, because I just got it, I really don't really know what I'm doing, is that you need to think of think of these in clusters of four because the in that cluster of flow of four one row is the blow and one row is the draw so you're not going to get because there's there's a there's a there's two notes per per column if you will you're not going to be able to play blow and draw on the same note so you sort of have to think of it as as, as, a, as one hole as being that cluster of four. And then it seems like the tuning is something like the middle of a diatonic or a chromatic harmonica. So sort of an in-out pattern will give you that, that basic major type scale. See if I can do it. I, I think it's in C, but it's not stamped on it. So what do I know? So there's a, there's a C scale. So what I did was... Um, I don't even know what the numbers are, but I, I, it's blow, draw, blow, draw, blow, draw, draw, blow, right? Um, go back to one of my other videos where I talk about the major scale, but it's that same pattern that's in the middle of the diatonic harmonica. And so all I really know how to do, guys, is play, play basic, um, basic melodies in the, in, the major, in the major key by ear. That's all I'm doing. But I encourage you folks to... You know, use this to get a feel for the harmonica. It's, you know, you hold hold it just like any other harmonica. Um, put your lips on it. Learn to breathe through it like any other harmonica. Even the principles are the same. And and have fun with it, guys. And you know, play at the campfire. Uh, mess around with it. And and let me know when you get a diatonic harmonica, and I, I can teach you a whole lot more. So there's my 32 harmonica spiel. Um, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for writing. Uh, I hope I hope you have fun. If, if this is what you've got. Hey, rock it. Have a good time with it. That's what I'm going to do.
Thanks for watching. <laughs>